Hello everybody, you are on Andrei Mihalovi channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to install Windows 11, the latest version, on unsupported computer. And benefits of this way that you will have option to save all your apps, program, including data. I'm just a human, after all, and previously I made several video about this topic. But you know, I forget to mention one important thing. And after you do this, you will have option to save all your programs, apps, including data. So let's get it started. So guys, we are in the Windows. Right now I'm running Windows 10. So you may see my desktop. So I will show you my specification, specification of my laptop and the version of the Windows. Right now I'm running on Windows 10 Pro and this is spec of my computer, Intel Core i3 of 3rd generation, 8GB of RAM. Windows activated, definitely I appreciate every user who use license Windows. So we will close this window. So friends, the thing is, I want to upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11 on unsupported computer, but also the most important, I want to save all my apps and all my programs. One of my viewers write me very useful comment. So definitely I read all of your comments. And now I want to read very useful comment from John Gord. John, if you watch this video, thank you. So John wrote me in the comment. Yes, Andrew, another thing you must do is download the correct language version. Otherwise, it will not let you to save all apps and data. For example, if you have Windows 10 Pro in French, then you must choose the language when you download the multi-version ISO. If you download the English version and the machine is running a French version Windows 10 Pro, then it will not let you install Windows 11 Pro with all apps and data and will only install data. And definitely this is a very, very important comment. Another time, John, thank you. Because in my videos previously, I said that I can't figure out how to save all apps and data because I have only option to save data. And thanks to John, I figure out how to save all apps and data when we updating from Windows 10 to Windows 11. So guys, let's get it started. For the beginning, we need to open our browser another time. In my case, it will be Google Chrome browser. Then we need to type Windows 11 download and press enter. So here you may see Microsoft official website download Windows 11. So just click here and you may see download Windows 11, Windows 22 H2 version. So we need to scroll down a little bit. And here you may see download Windows 11 disk image ISO. We need to click here, select download. And we need to choose Windows 11 multi-edition ISO. After that, you need to click download another time wait a few minutes so friends please pay attention right now because i'm going to tell you very important information here we can select the language that will suit you the best and definitely you need to select your language but the thing is my system runs on windows 10 and previously i download ukrainian version iso file and that's why when i'm recording video and choosing english i can't save my apps and all my data so if we go to the settings i will show you the language I manually changed the language to English just to make it more convenient for my viewers, English United States. But in original it was Ukraine. So when I'm making my tutorials and showing you how to install it, so I chose English and that's normal. But in the installation process I don't have option to save apps. I have option to save data and that's because I select English. You need to select your language. So let's get back to our website. I will select English one more time and I will select Ukrainian just to show you the difference. Click confirm, wait a few minutes and right now we have option to download ISO file. Click on it 
and in this case I need to find Ukrainian Ukrainian and click confirm wait a few minutes another time and voila I also have option to download ISO file click here and wait until ISO file will be download on your computer so friends as you can see I already download Windows ISO files English version and Ukrainian version so right now I will run English version just to show you that my system doesn't support Windows 11 officially and after that I will show you how to bypass Windows 11 system requirements so click here after that you need to find setup click on it and now we see the next window install Windows 11 let click next check in for updates so friends you may see that my computer doesn't meet Windows 11 system requirements don't support TPM 2.0 and the specs of the processor so definitely we need to close this window and as you can see my laptop really doesn't support Windows 11 so I will show you how to bypass Windows 11 system requirements for this we need to open this text document and copy this link a link will be in the video description so we need to go another time to our browser, insert link and press enter. And here you may see Windows 11 text document. If we look to the upper right corner, we have option to download our text document. Click on it. And voila, we download our text document. So I will show it in folder and move it to our desktop to make it more convenient for you okay i will close this window now we need to open our text document click on it after that you need to click on file select save as and now please pay attention because this is very important stage we just need to type dot cmd dot cmd and after that be sure to click here and choose all files we need to select for all files okay save it and as you can see windows 11 appear on our desktop so we can close this window i will move it closer to our files so now we just need to click on this file this file will help to bypass windows 11 system requirements and definitely you do not need to press any button so click on it and now we just need to wait until it will bypass windows 11 system requirements that's all so we can delete this file because it already do all the job and the most important that I want to show you right now I will run English version and show you that my system will not have option to install apps click on it one more time find setup click on it so let's click next getting updates checking for updates another time voila for many users this is very very happy window because you able to install windows 11 so definitely you can click accept so friends and now you may see the reason why i making this video because here we don't have option to select keep file settings and apps and i have only one option i mean two option to select nothing or keep personal file only and that's because this is not the original language of my system my language is ukrainian so i can close this window yes and i will run ukrainian version click on setup so friends another time in this window we need to click here in ukrainian it's mean daily in english next so it also check for some updates отримати оновлення деякі операції вже виконано and now we see the similar window but in Ukrainian and here we need to click on accept прийняти finally we have the third option and that's mean that we can save all our programs apps and other files 
So the thing is, you need to select the correct language. If you have a Ukrainian original ISO file, you need to select Ukrainian. If you have a French ISO file, select French ISO file. If you have English, select English. In other cases, you will not have option to save all your apps and programs. So after that, you can click next and install Windows. Definitely right now, I don't want to install it. I make a lot of video where I showing you in detail how to install it on unsupported hardware, on all the laptops and computer. And definitely you can watch all of this video on my channel. So friends, I think it will be more than enough for today. So guys, if this video was useful for you, please like it. And definitely don't forget to subscribe to my channel, it will help me a lot. Also, on my channel you can watch a lot of interesting videos, and I will be gladful if you watch all of them. Goodbye everyone, see you soon.